It's that time of year when we tend to take a look back at the year in review. And today, Buffalo Mayor Byron Brown joins us on the couch with his wrap up of a pretty big year in Buffalo. Right now, Mr. Mayor, we're looking at lots of snow outside. So we have to ask you, people love to know what the situation is with the snow plows. So what is our situation right now with the fleet? Is everyone going to be safe? Yeah, yeah, everyone's going to be safe. Our situation is pretty good. We have uh, 72 um, uh, pieces of uh, equipment in our snow fleet. Uh, since 2006, we've spent over $10 million on new equipment. We have GPS on our plows. We have alt automated salt spreaders. And we have uh, 70 um, uh, truck drivers, operators, that are some of the most experienced snow fighters in the entire nation. That's what you need when you live in Buffalo, right? That's what we need. You, you absolutely need that. And just an example, uh, yesterday when it snowed, we had our trucks out pre-salting. Uh, we had trucks on the road when people were going home, and it made the commute home very smooth in the city of Buffalo last night. Do you hear from other mayors around the country about how to prepare for snowy weather and what kind of things we do here in Buffalo? Because we really kind of set the scene for this. You know what? It's, uh, it, it's funny, but over the years, we have heard from other mayors asking uh, for tips on what we do, asking about equipment that we purchase, uh, asking how we, we do it. So it's been pretty gratifying to know that Buffalo is viewed as one of the most effective uh, communities in the nation when it comes to snow fighting. We gotta be, that's right. But we're, you know, we're looking back at 2013 as being a really big year for Buffalo. A lot of different development projects going on. What do you think this year will be remembered for in the city? You know, I think it will be uh, remembered as a, a banner year for development in the city of Buffalo. Uh, between 2012 and 2013, over $2.2 billion of projects that actually move forward. And All that's of those, a new figure, right? That $2.2 billion that, number? That is a new figure. Uh, so in 2013, we topped over $2.2 billion in development. It seems like more and more people across the state, across the nation, internationally, are aware of the development that's taking place in the city of Buffalo. And every week in City Hall, we're getting um, more investors, more developers, more business people that are visiting the city that are looking at making additional investments in, in our community. A couple big things coming up for next year will be the opening of Harbor Center downtown. Also that we have these clean energy companies coming here to develop uh, some more of the waterfront property. Tell us about, about that. Yeah, Harbor Center is going to be really huge. Uh, that grew out of a uh, city um, uh, surface parking lot. Uh, I parked 300 cars. We had a, uh, uh, an international competition uh, through a request for a proposal to bid out that property. Uh, the Sabres organization won it. It's a $175 million project, two ice rinks, hotel, retail, restaurant, uh, over 800 car parking garage. It's going to attract over 500,000 additional people to the waterfront in downtown Buffalo every single year. Absolutely huge. And then we're also just looking at the Riverbend property. What's going to be happening there? Uh, Riverbend is a property that the city actually purchased in 2008. Uh, it's going to have two high tech, high tech companies that are coming in. Um, uh, Governor Andrew Cuomo was able to negotiate to bring these companies in. They're going to spend $1.5 billion, and they are going to um, create initially 850 jobs to make uh, Riverbend a high technology hub in the northeastern part of the United States, actually a high technology hub uh, in the world. It's really something really to look forward to in the new year. We uh, look, I'll always look forward to your visits, Mayor Brown and Brown, and we look forward to you visiting us more in 2014. Real quick, we definitely want to make sure we give a quick shout out to all of the local shops in, um, in the Elmwood Village, the Hurdle area, and other neighborhoods in the city for holiday shopping season. So important to shop local. Elmwood, Hurdle, uh, Bailey, Abbott, all of the great shopping that we have in the city. Uh, when you shop local, you support your hometown, you support your neighborhood, you support 
support your neighbors. And those are some of the most generous businesses for supporting youth sports and charities in the community. So I encourage everyone to shop local and shop City of Buffalo businesses this holiday season. And to all of your viewers, a happy holiday and a happy new year. That's right. Happy holidays to you. And we love the Christmas tie. Maybe next time you come, you can come at the next uh, holiday and you can wear another festive tie. For that us. sounds great. All right. Sounds good. Buffalo Mayor Byron Brown. On